Welcome to this week's tech tip, where we'll take a look at how we can use EWS to extract a solid from a DXF or DWG. Here you can see that we have a basic DWG file that opens as a flat 2D drawing. Now if we select EWS from the setup toolbar, our drawing will open in the EWS interface where we can extrude it into a solid. If we take a look at the layers dialog, we can see the different drawing elements as we hover over them on the list. In this case, we want to extract our solid from the base profile, so we'll start by turning off the layers that we do not need. We can then use the Extract Sketch function to select the elements that will make up our sketch. If we window in the extents of our part, we can then deselect the holes before accepting the selection. We are now ready to extrude a solid from our profile. Select the extrude function and set the length to 0.5. Then select OK to confirm the solid. The next thing we need to do is add holes to the solid. We'll start by turning on the wireframe so that we can use the hole locations defined by the base drawing. Now select the drill command and choose the top face as our drawing plane. If we take a look at the hole library, you can see the available options for hole style and dimensioning. In this case, we'll select counterbore and use the dimension shown. You'll notice that we are able to easily snap to the hole center location and click to place the hole. Once the hole is placed, selecting apply will complete the feature. We can now continue on and complete the four remaining holes. We are now finished with the solid and can select done to save the model and open it in SurfCam where it's ready to manufacture. As always, we hope that you found this tech tip helpful and would like to encourage you to explore all of the available SurfCam tech tips.